Holy Mother of God. Ta 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 ta. Ta 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 ta. Ta 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 ta. So today is the big day, like again. There is a track that should be here in like two, two and a half hours. And I've already done all the preparation. Yeah, I bought a new CNC machine. And we'll see if my plan works out how we get this off the trailer, how I'm gonna set this up, and maybe learn a few things from, from there on. So, uh, last machine move I did was uh, kind of hard on equipment on and the bones. So this time I've hired a crew of professionals to do all that for me. And I think I'm going to introduce you to, to all of them. So have fun! So this goes to show that you can't really predict any of <laughs> of these movements. So the driver um, just had a really rough way here, got in a lot of traffic jams and was literally standing 500 meters from here but all, uh, already checked in like his rest times. This is the next morning. It just started to snow and we're gonna have a good time. So follow me. Alright, so here we are. Uh, this has got to be the like typical pandemic Sunday. I did wire in the uh, the main supply come from up here and uh, that PVC piping. And I already went ahead and put this also in the switching cabinet. So we can take a peek in here. As you can see, the machine is not leveled yet. Uh, from now on, you will see that almost everything is Siemens. There's your um, S7 PLC. And beneath the, that door, there's all that servo goodness. So this is all Simo Drive, Siemens-based. As you can see, there are a lot of them, as well as there are a lot of axes. So this is the whole chip conveyor assembly and all of that has to go in here. Back here I do have a lot of space. Only thing I have to take care of is this this door has to get different hinges so I can get that fully open. And well the outer appearance of the machine is kind of gross for what's in on the inside. Um, we go to the front. Well, I mean, it's not in the baddest of shape But everywhere you look there's just that thick slimy oily thing. We'll work around that. This is like panel from the Siemens 840 controller and With this really nice sliding door You can get a look inside the machine
how awesome is that? And the last and finishing touch, we'll see later on. Oh, this turned out beautiful. So the clever salesman would sell you this as a seven axis machine and that is because like each of these spindles can move completely individually and each of them has full five axis capability. So the whole tool assembly is coming towards us with the Y axis. This is X. Um, the whole revolver uh, does the B axis. Each of the spindles can be um, controlled rotationally wise with the, I guess it's the C axis. And both of them uh, move towards, towards each other with the Z, Z axis. So I guess this explains it the best and this is for both spindles.